my first approach to drawing, I mean, even since I was a kid, was always just like starting with shapes. You know, just drawing like blobs. And I think still to this day, I start off just sort of drawing rough sort of body or shape and then ca like carve it and erase it out and, until I figure out what it is. Well, I didn't go to art school. Um, I, I think I had like one figure drawing class in high school and then like a new figure drawing class. And then, in, you know, in college I was an English major and, and then I worked for years. And it wasn't until I found myself like living back in Los Angeles with not really a whole lot to do living with my sister who's a painter that I sort of started like scribbling again and drawing and stuff and then going to art shows and seeing what people were doing I thought oh that would be really fun you know I'm gonna, gonna make my own thing. Now looking back it's weird but when I took that art class it originally um, was a figure drawing class and I remember the teacher thinking I was bored because I always drew um, like capes and I drew like afros or hats on all my characters. He's like hey maybe you should go to um, try new, new drawing and I was like, yeah, oh man, this is gonna be awesome, you know? And I remember going to that class and it, and it was all sort of like obese, rotund, fat, like people, because they have more curves and more shapes. And at the time as a kid, I didn't get it. And now it's kind of ironic because that's what I draw because there is more sort of like, sort of balance and shape to it versus drawing like really skinny people, I guess. I really never knew how to define the sort of like the style of art I did, but I think through just shows and hearing people talk about it, I've come to terms with maybe it being a illustrative, <laughs> narrative, um, you know, not really illustration. I use that word, but it's not, I don't really do draw editorials or really magazine illustrations. But um, I think because it's just pe you know pen and ink or ink and brush that has a real sort of illustrative quality to it. So I, I generally call it just like narrative. Illustrative drawing. I think I started branching out into color because I really like it. I see artwork and the artwork I like is all super colorful. So then I, I really try to make an effort and, and sort of figure out how to incorporate more color into my works by changing the paper.